Okay guys, we're back and um, actually this is a video unboxing and first impression of a pair of Jordans that I ordered um, last Saturday, May the 24th at 8 a.m. from Champs. So I'd like to give a good shout out to my friends and everybody at Champs um, for this hookup um, and giving me the opportunity to get these. I know a lot of people was probably bouncing back and forth site to site trying to get their hands on these. It was a lot of hot new releases and colorways that came out last week. Um, basically, got them out the shipping box from Champs. And we're getting ready to open them up. I know you guys are excited, especially for um, first time Jordan buyers or collectors, or just people that want to add these to the collection, or some people that were skeptical of these just by looking at pictures. And they definitely want to see uh, a semi in depth review, um, in my opinion, of what is a hot Jordan release. And something um, people definitely may want to get their hands on. So we're going to spin the box around. Of course, you see the black box, white jump man on top, and just so you can see the authenticity of these um, from the box point of view. Um, like I said, these came from Champ Sports. 150 bucks. They are Jordan 2 Retro, and yeah, these are called the Iron Purples. Uh, that's the code name for this particular colorway. Yeah, so let's actually open this box up. Boom. There you have it. Yeah. The purple really pops in person. Shoe strings really bring out the shoe. With the carmine speckles. And the speckles across the bottom of the sole, which is an air unit that you don't see. I think the first Jordan with an air unit, because these are only the second Jordan. And um, just a little history on the Retro 2. I think when it was first released, I think it was only like 69 bucks, maybe. Uh, maybe a little bit more than that. Uh, you guys let me know if I'm right or wrong. Um, and also, this shoe dates back. You know, it came out in the 80s. And, um, you know, this was before the rings and all of that. Um, these was released in 1986 slash 1987 for very supportive midsole. That was the main feature. Um, and the shoe is ill. In other words, it's good. It's killing them. Uh, from my point of view right now, from my POV, uh, you see the ventilation going across the toe of the shoe and all the way around and this material right here is like a new buck material notice the details around the wing also you guys get to see the back with the Nike that pops and just in case uh, you had those guys that or females that don't try to pay attention at first <laughs> when you know they are um, this is it Definitely on point. Let me get this little piece out that sort of keeps the shoe um, in the correct form. Let's look down inside here. Yeah, you see the jump man on the inside. Also, the front of the tongue. A lot of cats like this. Females, too. If you're um, copying a shoe for yourself or for one of your friends or a family member. Well, look at all these specific details. See how the tongue is black? You can see it behind the shoestrings. And where they lace. It's black. It pops. So like I said, if you're wearing black jeans. Dark Levi's. Straight. Classic. Um, loose fit. This is definitely on point. The white across the bottom. No ice, but yeah, it's white on this colorway, which I think is cool. Could have been black too, would have been cool. Or could it? Look at the bottom. Yeah. Not too much of an arch. Um, yeah, these shoes are pretty cool. 
definitely worth the price but like um, good materials on this particular retro I give it a thumbs up on a scale of 1 to 10 I'll probably give it like a 9.5 um, I'm not going to do an on foot yet because uh, I am recording this from my Nexus 5 uh, phone so hopefully it's crisp enough for you guys to um, see and enjoy and yeah this is uh, one of my first unboxings many more to come of all types of different things but right now it's all about the retro two iron purples here they go both of them can't just have one back side top front bottom yeah no one can hate on these but some may but it's all about you and what you like and your vision. Well, if you want to collect these, you know, put them in the stash, break them out a few seasons later just to let them know. I hope you enjoyed the video. Hit like, subscribe. Or well, if you didn't like this video or think something should have been done different, opinions or valued, hit me up. Let me know. This is P. Signing off on the retro two iron purples by Michael Jordan 2014 style